hello everyone in this video we are going to see that how can you fix any of the errors that you are getting while updating your windows pc so many a times uh, windows pc users face problems where after despite trying multiple times the windows updates just fail to install or they fail to update the system properly so in case you are facing the same issue i am here to tell you the solution for the same so the process is pretty simple let us start the first thing you need to do is just uh, go to the search bar and type in windows so we need to actually get to windows update settings so just type in windows and if the update settings don't come just type u so update settings will come just click on there this will open up the windows update settings make sure that you notice two things first thing is you are up to date the windows is updated but in case you are facing some errors you won't be able to get this particular message so in this case go to os build info and here in the windows specifications make note of two things the installed on date and the os build so installed on is 27 december 2022 in my case okay so the next step is go to the file explorer from there go to this pc go to windows uh, c drive basically go to the windows folder then you need to go to a folder that says software distribution here make sure that its date modified is also the same that is 27th december 2022 in my case the installed on date is 27th uh, december and the software distribution date modified is also 27 december if you open it up you will find a file or a folder that is dated as 27 december so that means your updates have been installed now what you need to do is go to troubleshoot settings so just type in troubleshoot in your search bar go to the troubleshoot settings once it is opened go to additional troubleshooters then uh, there is the problem with a windows update like get up and running there is a windows update option that says the resolve the problems that prevent you from updating windows just click on that and click on run the troubleshooter so this will run the troubleshooter for you it will take five to seven minutes uh, just to make sure that any of the issues that you are facing in this particular case they are removed they are solved then once it has run successfully you need to restart your system and then you will see that your windows have been updated that's it for this video. Thanks for watching.